Hey there philosophers and welcome now to Wednesday. Well for the next 36 hours I think it's going to be a bit more partly cloudy for our Sagittarian friends. That's because the moon is moving into Scorpio and transiting your house of karma basically. The house of higher consciousness in the spiritual realm or subconscious in the physical realm. Either way it's the consciousness just beyond our consciousness and that means when your heart is tied up with that you're going to be triggered by subconscious issues or karmic issues. This often are issues dealing with your home and family and that really does underline a big theme going on this month for you. So emotionally you're going to find your charge for the next 36 hours with karma or childhood history. Now what's also interesting is the moon today in particular is trining the Mercury Neptune conjunction going on for you in the third house, the house of thinking and communication. I think what the universe is trying to display to Sagittarians is your inner dialogue. Does it support a strong Sagittarius, a free Sagittarius, an open thinking Sagittarius? With the Mercury retrograde going on in the third house and opposing Saturn in the belief structure house, I think what Sagittarius are really dealing with is literally a seesaw or a tug of war between the way they are programmed and literally the way they operate moment to moment. You may have some of your programming ahead of the curve where you know this is the way to go, but your actual mind and mouth are not following those rules. Or it can be vice versa. You could be talking the talk, but in the background not really believing the walk. And that is kind of where some of the conflict is going on with Sagittarius right now. So today you're kind of in that conflict between your belief structure and what you actually practice in your mind. And it's tying in to the karmic issues of your childhood or past lives and fears and things like that. Don't forget, at the same time, the universe's core mode of this month is the Sun-Uranus conjunction, which is saying to all Sages, it's time to pick up the house and swap out the basement. That is, you're going to be led to a whole other understanding this month of how you should take care of yourself, the way family should have been, the way family should be now, and the best way to really be in a state of nesting. All right, that's all we have for Wednesday. See you tomorrow with more Soul Horoscopes. Live, love, be. So God and die.